question from a parent, Sophie. She said, "What should the role of a parent, or what should they say or do within the 24-hour window before their child's competition?" <laughs> you know,、um, what I would tell now, I'm, I'm a parent of five children that all competed, you know, in different sports. I have a I have a daughter that competes、uh, currently in, for Division One college in gymnastics. I have a daughter that competes for Division One college in, in, in track and field. Um, my sons were good wrestlers in high school, and, and California was a CIF champion, and and so I've got kids that love sports and train sports. And you know what? Except for the gymnasts, they're doing sports that I don't have a lot of knowledge about. You know, I don't really. I mean, I I, I love watching wrestling. I love watching my daughter run, but I'm not the expert. So what I tell my kids is、uh, is, is trust your training, trust what you've done with your coach, trust your coach, rely on what he taught you, what she taught you, rely on. Uh, on all the time and the effort you've put in, and then just go with the flow. But you know, I, I I try not to mess with their heads and try to say, hey, so what are you thinking about now? What are you going? Okay, here's what I think you should do. And as a parent, if we're not in the gym every day with our child, or if we're not on the playing field every day with our child, and we're not coaching them or watching them or really really tied into their training, I, I would hesitate giving some cool advice we read on the internet from some other athlete or. Some Olympic gymnast and all that. I would say, hey, trust your training. Trust what you're doing with your coach. You're ready. You're ready. What can I do for you? How can I help you? Ask those questions instead. Go to sportsmentaltoughness.com to get your free video training and guided visualization MP3 on how to perform under pressure. I'm Craig Sigel, the mental toughness trainer.